Hello guys and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be taking this Nissan Kicks SV on a POV test drive. So basically, I'm going to tell you how the Nissan Kicks drives like and uh, what do I think about it and uh, does it have a good amount of power or is the 122 horsepower more than enough uh, for this uh, small SUV. So I'm just I'm going to go ahead and take it on a test drive and uh, basically uh, tell you uh, what I think about it. All right, so let's go ahead and take this Nissan Kicks on a test drive. So this Nissan Kicks has the 1.6 liter four cylinder and it has 122 horses and 114 feet of torque and uh, drives pretty good and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and show you a quick acceleration in a minute uh, but steering feels very uh, good very direct and uh, sitting position is great and uh, the ride is actually not that bad I'm hearing a little bit of road noise uh, but it's honestly not that bad for a $22,000 uh, small SUV like this one brakes feel very nice and solid too And this one actually has the blind spot monitoring system, which is very good. And uh, if you guys are curious, this one is the SV trim and it has uh, the blacked out rims and uh, they're 17s by the way. And they are like, I think um, a $200 option, I think, or uh, probably $250 option, I believe. Um, but yeah, I mean, honestly, I really like the way how this SUV drives. Very small, very easy to drive. Steering wheel is very nice and light uh, in uh, parking lots. So going between cars and the small parking lots, this steering wheel is actually very good and very light. But yeah, the steering wheel feels very good. Um, this one does not have a sport mode. I mean, I understand it's a small SUV and it doesn't need one, but if there was a sport mode, it would have been a little bit better. Uh, for better accelerations and stuff like that especially like merging on the highway but honestly it drives very nice and smooth as I said I'm gonna go ahead and uh, show you a little bit of acceleration right here in a minute It has a weird humming noise. I'm not exactly sure what's that noise, but when you are slowing down, you hear it, then it goes away. So I'm not exactly sure what's that noise from. Let's go ahead and get on it. It's actually not that bad. And the only reason it's not that bad is because that the SUV is very light and having 122 horsepower is more than enough for a small SUV like this one. But honestly, overall, it drives very nice and smooth. I'm very impressed. And I wasn't honestly expecting a good uh, pull like this one. So drives very nice and smooth. As I said, the steering wheel is very nice and light. I'm gonna go ahead and show you how the steering wheel is. And I really like the turning radius on uh, the kicks. It's very, very light. You could literally do it with one finger and the steering wheel turns. And I, I like the fact that the engine is, is not sluggish or lazy uh, when you hit the gas, but Honestly, when accelerating from a stop, it's honestly not that bad. As I said, I wasn't expecting the way how it responded. Um, it pulled very good and hard, and uh, I'm honestly and truly impressed by the power this uh, Kicks has. Uh, the K 
kicks is actually paired to a CVT transmission and honestly the CVT is very smooth um, honestly I thought it's not gonna be that good but honestly it's very nice and smooth and it doesn't even feel like a CVT um, I heard that Nissan did not do very good back then with their CVTs but from what I'm seeing right now their CVT is honestly responsive it does have a little bit of jerk at first um, but then it goes away I'm not exactly sure why is that that could be probably a CVT or it could be the engine uh, but very smooth and once once it reaches 5,000 6,000 it pulls even harder with, the, with, with like with it being around 5,000 or 6,000 rpms you feel it pull even better or harder but I'm truly impressed with the way how it drives uh, and the seats are pretty comfortable and um, Honestly, everything is good about this SUV. If you guys want like a small SUV like this one, I would definitely put this Nissan Kick on your list. It drives very nice and smooth, and for the price, honestly, it's not that bad. It's a $22,000 SUV, and probably with discounts and, uh, with discounts and rebates, probably you could get it for nineteen or 20000 Good thing about this one, this one has all the safety features standard, so... You don't have to add any options or any packages uh, on the kicks uh, to be able to get all the link keep assist, emergency braking, and all these safety features. So guys, that's it for this video. I hope you guys liked it. I would like to thank Frank and Napoli Nissan in Milford. I'm going to go ahead and put their link in the description of this video. And I'm going to go ahead and put their information as well. And if you guys would like to see more videos like this, please subscribe. And as always, I'll see you next time.